Hey Delilah, do you want some makeup? Yeah, sure. Hello. Hi Jared. You know how to use mirror? No. Why? I'm trying to use it. And he has brown use it for my face. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Is that yours? Hey, are you guys gonna come do this photo? We're waiting for you. Coming! Oh, you guys look great. Look at you. You clean up nice there, Jared. <laughs> Thanks, you Dad. Pretty, you look pretty too, Delilah and Jasmine. All right, is everybody ready? You guys all got your good faces on? Yeah. Now remember, the quicker we do this, the quicker we can go and do our things, okay? All right, here we go. Just gonna go over here. All right, and one, three, nice smile. All right, good. Let's see how that one worked out. Okay. See if that was just something weird? Sure. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's a glitch. I hope so too. I hope that guy's not in our house still. Smile. about that. We've been living here for years and never heard anything about that. Let me Google that. Hold on one second here. Hey Google. Tell me stories about missing children in the San Arm area in the last 30 years. Look at this. Big city horror in a small town, August 22nd, 1993. When searchers found the bludgeoned body of Derek Robbie, aged 10 years and 11 months, in a clump of trees on the edge of park, the residents of this upstate town overcame with shock and horror to behave with all the virtues that are associated with small towns. Ministers consoled the parents of the boy and made arrangements for his funeral. Friends and neighbors came by with home-baked cakes and food, while others made plans for Labor Day, country and western Egypt to help play the cost of saying farewell to Derek. But when state police investigators announced they had cracked the case with the arrest of a killer who they said confessed to enticing the boy into a patch of weeds and trees and beating and choking him to death, the, the 13,000 residents of Salmon Arm were left with a big city kind of numbness. Led away in handcuffs was 13-year-old Eric Smith, a friend of Derek, who, with his tousled red hair, freckles, and aviator glasses, looks like an updated version of Tom Sawyer. Oh, there's even a picture of the kid here. Hold on one second. Whoa. What? He looks just like that kid that was in our pictures. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. 
It looks just like him. Wait, can I see well, that again? The hair, at least. Yeah, right. He's wearing the same. He's wearing the, the same, same sweater, sweater and, swim, and the same pants. The long hair. He's got the orange hair. Oh boy. What are we gonna do about it? I don't know, but let's not talk about this anymore. Dinner is ready, and I'm gonna go get it. Okay. Let's talk Cut. about something else. No. Okay, set the lights out. Night. Yeah. Alright, night night, sweeties. Night, Daddy.